guys welcome back to my channel my name is Soph if you're new and today is Tuesday June 1st and it's currently 10 I just woke up not that long ago and I showered and I figured today would be a really good day to film a what I eat in a day like an updated one because I don't really eat gluten-free necessarily anymore but I still try to stick to like mainly whole foods diet so I have my water here I always start my morning off drinking like at least a whole one of these because I feel like that's what wakes me up the fastest so I try to drink a lot of water in the morning I just finished taking my care of vitamins for this morning today's quote is if an opportunity doesn't knock build a door I think that's a really good quote actually but I really like care of because those little packets are now compostable which is really really great because now the vitamins aren't only good for you but it's also good for the environment and it doesn't harm anything so and I really like how convenient they are and just easy to travel with or just oh I always remember to take them because it comes in that big box and I just put it right there on my dresser and it's just really really convenient but now it's currently like I said 10 a.m. I'm gonna make some breakfast probably some toast and I made cold brew last night so that's in the fridge thank goodness and then I'm gonna get something pretty exciting for lunch I'm really excited except it's not really like a lunch food but like I'm gonna have it for lunch so stay tuned for that so like I said for breakfast I think I'm just gonna make a slice of toast recently I've been using the Bavarian premium sandwich sourdough bread Rudolph's and it's I don't know I guess that's the kind of it oh flavor full mixed grains sourdough bread whatever and then I'm gonna make a little egg because I got a new package of eggs the other weekend when I went home so I'm gonna make my last little egg from the last one with my toast and I'm also going to make my coffee that I made last night my egg but I didn't realize hold on I'm gonna need the thing so when I was making the eggs I didn't really <laughs> realize how small it was I mean I did but like I guess now that it's on the plate I didn't so good thing I have this toast but normally I have spinach and I just make eggs and spinach and then I have toast on the side but I ran out of spinach so I'll have to go get some more if I'm gonna do that but that's okay for one day, I'm just having regular eggs and toast, and I'm gonna jazz this up a little bit. And also, I know I burnt half, but that's fine. I like it a little crunchy. with some almond butter and banana and a little egg and I'm so excited to eat this. My class is gonna start in like 10 minutes and then once that class is done I'm gonna go and get my lunch because I'm so 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 excited but that class is gonna be like two hours long so that kind of sucks. Oh I gotta make my coffee. I'm gonna make my coffee now and by make I mean pour it into here I like to switch what I have in my coffee like this one I put like cow's milk like regular milk 
sometimes I do almond milk, sometimes I do oat milk. It just depends on my mood and what I'm buying at the grocery store that way. I was really craving this cereal right here, the almond crisp or oatmeal crisp almond. It's so good. I love it. So I don't really like cereal with almond milk. I think that's disgusting. So that's why I bought the cow's milk. But now I'm gonna do my dishes because I'm a good roommate. <laughs> So now that I'm done the dishes and cooked my breakfast, I'm gonna go eat it and go to my next class. And then by the time that's over, I'm gonna be ready for lunch and I'm gonna be so excited. You have no idea. Ah. Oh my goodness, you guys. So now it's finally lunchtime. It's currently 3.09 p.m. I finally finished the class at like 2.45 and then I rushed over here because I have my eyelash appointment at 4.30 but she said she's free anytime and I said okay I'll come right after my class but I knew I had to grab lunch first of course but that's what we're doing. But before I go I am gonna stop at the farm boy just down there because I forgot a water bottle. I know I'm not about plastic water bottles but I forgot one and I know I'll get really dehydrated sitting there if I don't bring it especially for like on the car ride and stuff and there's also a few things i need for dinner tonight so i'm gonna go grab that and yeah my voice is so groggy because i haven't talked in like the last three hours that's so funny i really don't think it would be one of my videos if i didn't stop here <laughs> that's so funny let's go Hey guys, you might have guessed it. I'm coming to get an acai bowl. And I'm so, so, so excited. I got the tropical bowl. I don't know if it's on there. No, that's just the ingredients, but I bet it's gonna be so yummy. Wow, guys, it looks pretty good. Oh. There's blueberries, banana, coconut, granola, honey, acai, delish. So guys, from Farm Boy, I just grabbed a big Smart Water, like I said I was going to, and then I just grabbed a small bag of Spring Mix. I really like how they just make it themselves and put it in a little bag because this was like three dollars, two fifty-seven. It was good from now until June six, so I have six days to eat all this, which I will. So that's really good, but. Really want to try this. It looks so good. It looks just like a fresh bowl of just what I want right now. So guys, it's 8.22, dinner time. I'm just gonna make like a little type of Mexican bowl, make do sort of thing. I'm just gonna put some of this spring mix and then, oh, I'm just gonna take some of the spring mix like as a bed of it and then put some chickpeas, corn, some of this oriental rice that's just like in the one minute to cook thing. And then we have some shredded carrots and cucumber and then I'll probably also Put on some salsa so i'm really excited to eat this emma's here if you see her legs but the uh, <laughs> but i really like this meal because it's just super easy and quick and it really does fill you up because of the chickpeas and the rice but it's very whole food based you can always add cheese or sour cream if you want as well but i don't tend to do that every time although i do have some cheese maybe i'll make one tomorrow for lunch and put cheese on it
guys, and that is the finished salad. It's quite easy, honestly. It took me, what, three seconds to put together, but I'll just put on the salsa now, too, and then it's perfect. I think it's super easy because it's like so easy to just throw in a container like this and just have one for work or school or whatever you gotta do throughout the day. You can easily make it the morning of or even the night before because nothing will really go soggy, especially if you put the salsa on after. But I'm really, really excited to eat this and yeah. I was just putting everything away and I remembered that I bought these microgreens from Farm Boy yesterday, so I'm also going to add some of these on there. They're just really good for like getting extra vitamins and minerals that you might need throughout the day, especially Today I had a day where I ate a lot of fruit and not a lot of vegetables so I tried to get a whole bunch of vegetables in this meal and then it looks super yummy. So guys, it's a lot later now as you can probably tell. I got my eyelashes done earlier, like I mentioned, they look so good. She did one to one lashes, like one and then glue one eyelash instead of one to three lashes this time. I really like how they look a lot less effort, like they just look a little more effortless and natural and that's what I was really going for. But what I was gonna say is it's obviously like dessert time, whatever you wanna call it, because it's 10, 16 and this is normally the time when I'd have like ice cream or dessert of some sort, but tonight I'm honestly just not feeling it. I think it was all the sugar in the fruits that I ate today that made me not really crave something sweet, which is totally fine. I think that is what is important here is to listen to your body. Always eat whatever it's asking you to, whether if you if your body's asking you for McDonald's, then girl, go get your McDonald's, unless like it's telling you every day to go get McDonald's, maybe don't go, but do whatever makes you feel comfortable. Just listen to your body and yeah. I really hope you guys enjoyed this what I eat in a day. If you did, then please give it a huge thumbs up because it really supports my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.